clients today. They are leaving tomorrow and booked a charter. Of course, this one's in advance. We have no idea this was coming. It's 55 degrees, which for this Florida girl feels like I'm freezing. My, my hands are like almost numb. It's cold. I got three lines out so far. I'm going to put some tough bait out. Let's get to fishing. It's getting blown way over here. Um, I think it's just the sinker. This is only rated for four, but I can try a five ounce, but I'm just gonna have to be real careful when I sling it out there. I can't do a full on cast. Four ounce sinker is not holding. Oh, there we go. Yeah, that looks like it might be a little bonnet head shark. So yeah, roll it all the way up. He's pretty small. You wanna roll with your, your baby shark? <laughs> So we'll use some pliers here to get them off. It's pretty easy. Sorry, yeah. All right, dude, you gotta go back. What's that? You got a baby hammerhead? It's a it's a bonnet head. Oh, bo oh what yeah. Like my, like no, yeah, people something. call it like a shovel nose yeah, or yeah, a bonnet okay. head. I yeah, you got a little hammerhead. I had to no, see it. Okay. No, no, oh, yeah. yeah. Not not too rare. <laughs> All right, have a good day. Be a catfish. Oh, we do have, I hate catfish. <laughs> we do have saltwater catfish, yes. <laughs> oh my god! But that's a big one, actually. All right, here, you're too ugly. We can't keep <laughs> So, just like uh, freshwater catfish, these have barbs. So, we want to be really careful. Some people just take them off with um, pliers. I like to kind of control the fish. I'll throw him back. Hopefully, he won't. Come back. We need a better fish on the line. Oh, there we go. Another catfish. <laughs> I hate catfish. Actually, that's a whiting. I like that kind of catfish. No, that, yeah, that is actually good to eat. Yeah. Did you want to take fish home yes, today? Yes, I do. Awesome. He's kind of tired. <laughs> he may have been on there a little while. Go back here. He can be squirmy, though. I think I'm going to switch everything to that purple clam because everything's been biting on the purple clam today so this is why I try to be equipped with lots of different flavors of things that way we figure out what they want then we just switch it all to what they want yeah, I wanted to do something different with this one anyways I'm gonna throw out a piece of cut bait because yesterday we were catching bluefish and sharks on the cut bait so um, we'll use a little bit bigger hook and I've, I've got chunks of mullet in my in my uh, cooler. You feel it fighting? Wow, these waves are crazy. Oh yeah, we got something on there. Oh, we got bluefish. Nice. Yep, keep it coming in. He's probably not big enough to keep. They got to be 12 inches to the fork in the tail, but not bad. I'll, I'll get this out of the way if you want to put that one down. And I'll throw this out because we don't have anything in the water right now, so I'll toss this out. There, there might be something on this one. I think it's a fish, so we'll see what we got here. Maybe another bluefish. Another bluefish. Yeah, they like that cut bait. There we go. Keep reeling it up. Dude, okay. Get right in the tongue. Oh, like the, the flesh of the piece is gone. He just bit on the skin. <laughs> All right, we'll measure them up here. Almost 10 and a half inches. Ew. You're a little too small, buddy. Go tell your big brother to come on out and play because we want to play with your big brother, not you. Sorry. See ya. I think the bluefish school came through. So you'll want to keep reeling, keep tension on the line, get it in. Another bluefish, I think. It's a smaller one, I think. It's hard to tell from further away, but yeah. Definitely another bluefish. Nice, good job. All right, Oh yeah, there he is. Oh, it's got doubles. Double <laughs> fishes. There we go, double blues. Oh crap, neither one are big enough. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know if they are, but that's pretty cool. 
I don't know. That bottom one might be a little... It looks a little bigger. <laughs> All right, smile. Both of them are about 11 and a half. So, yeah. You want to hold, hold both of them? <laughs> if you want to try, just stay out of the uh, current there. There she goes. If we have bluefish this thick, we might... Yeah. Well, if we put if we put cut bait on all the lines, we may have better chance of uh, of doing that. It's another bluefish. All right, let's get this up here. All right, buddy. Let's see how big you are. Definitely not 15. <laughs> I think we've got right at 12. That one's getting hit again. I don't know. That that looks bigger to me. It they look smaller farther away, but yeah, that that might be a little bigger. Wow. There we go. Measure him up here. He's just over 12. Okay, we'll take it. All right. normal conditions, I'll usually move the lines down as the tide goes out, but it keeps coming up higher than what I expect. Yeah, this guy, <laughs> let me see this bite mark, he got bit <laughs> on the way in, <laughs> and he is like 12 and a half. Yeah! He is another keeper. Woo! 